Dobriner's Law of Triads. It was around the beginning of 19th century that a German chemist attempted the classification of then known elements. It was none other than Johann Wolfgang Dobriner who did so. He classified the elements known at that time in a particular manner. He placed up into the groups having three elements each. Do you think these groups will have elements arranged randomly? Of course not. Dobr so what's the unique way of placing these elements? That simple. Dobrinus arranged these uh, three elements in such a way that the average atomic mass of the first element and the third element is equal to the average atomic mass of the second element. Let's find out. The average ma average atomic mass of the element A and element C is 2 plus 4 divided by 2 gives us 3, which is the atomic average atomic mass of element B. So let us take some examples to understand better. So here is the suggested triad by Dobrino. Element Lithium, sodium, potassium. The atomic mass of lithium is 6.9 with that of potassium is 39. So the average of lithium and potassium gives us 23 and we know that the uh, atomic mass of sodium is 23. In simple words, the atomic mass of the second element will be approximately equal to the average of the atomic masses of the first and the third element. However, it is not perfect method of classification because Dobrino strides had drawbacks. He could identify only three triads. He was not able to prepare triads of all elements. All the known elements could not be arranged in the form of triads.